So here we are at the Country Club of St. Albans on the West Range Project, and I'm joined by Lance Norwood, Professional Golf Services. Lance, tell us a little bit about the old tee and the problems that we've corrected. I had multi-levels, too small, and a lot of Bermuda grass growing in it, and now in a horrible mat that was only four feet deep. Right. Now we've got a synthetic surface that'll be at least 10 feet wide. We can warm up 20 people on our practice facilities, even after a hard rain, and We've got a huge improved space. Tell us a little bit about the old tee and what was wrong with that. Well, along with it not being big enough for your membership, it was uh, not drained properly, had uh, no subsurface drainage. None at all. It, it, it was pitched a couple of different wacky ways. We've got it all 1%, a little more front to back now. Okay. Um, we've reconditioned the soil so you don't have that compacted soil profile. Um, and of course it's laser level. And uh, we've got the new 10 foot wide hitting stations, winter stations that stretch 95 feet, um, so it should be accommodate 20 golfers or so. That's right, you should, sure can. The other thing, Lance, I want you to talk about is what's new with the new range tee. I mean, what, what are the big improvements that we're going to see? So let's talk about cart staging for one. Our cart paths there. Oh, we increased double, triple. The, you know, you had a two-way system on the old, old, old tee that was two levels, two different grades. Now we've got one nice highway if you will but that it looks formal looks looks really nice and, and flows well that'll uh, let cart traffic go back and forth from 9 to 10 as well as parking for the range um, of course I mentioned the drainage and square footage uh, yeah we'll have increased parking at our range so that you can park and still have a nice quiet practice facility and still maintain traffic on the other side and we've got a great new teaching team as well and we have a great new individual instruction area yes that's exactly it's more aligned down the golf facility right. and it's not cocked off to the side. Right. Also, we plan for the future. If we ever were to enclose it, we've got a space big enough now to have an enclosed hitting area for teaching in the winter time. Can't wait. All right. Stay tuned for more. We'll be grassing hopefully before the end of the month. Here we are at the completed range tee. We've got the grassing done and the mats in, and it just looks fantastic, Lance. Thanks a lot. It's been a great driving range renovation. It matches the prestige and the, the presentation of the golf courses now with the renovation that you've done in the last year and a half. Thank you for a job well done. I'm going to miss you. Great to be a part of it. <laughs> Thank you, St. Albans. making St. Albans uh, renovated and just a fantastic place to belong, live, and, and oh, <laughs> that's Okay, Jim, what, what are you doing here, first of all? What's happening? You call your shot here? That's not I bad. Not bad. <laughs> I think you should hit off over. Bad. I think you need to hit over here. Over here there's a little <laughs> we'll, we'll edit that one.